Hi Scorpio, welcome. My name is Trina and this is TNT. Thank you for joining me today. All of my readings are timeless, so whenever you come across this reading, there should be something in here for you. I am doing a love reading for the sign of Scorpio today, Sun, Moon, Venus, and Rising, so please take what resonates and leave the rest for whoever needs it. So let's get at it. Okay, we have lightning, sudden change, shocking news, surprise, epiphany, upheaval, transformation. We have falling, the unknown, descent, momentum, and change. And we have karmic relationship, feeling triggers, turmoil, resentment, lessons, letting go, and loving you. Okay. All right then, so... Why do we have the lightning card here for Scorpio? Chariot. The Mother of Swords. And the Hierophant. So the Chariot, the Chariot, the Mother of Swords, and the Hierophant. <laughs> so this is like wanting to move forward you need to learn something first. You need to learn something first here. Hmm. Okay. Um, why do we have the falling card here for Scorpio? Why do we have the falling card here for Scorpio? Falling. We have the Nine of Swords, the Ten of Cups, and the Hanged Man. The Nine of Swords, the Ten of Cups, and the Hanged Man with Falling. So this is like an energy of manifesting the things that you don't desire accidentally, just by focusing on them. So with this fear and anxiety here, it's fear and anxiety about things going the way that they're actually going for you in, in reality, and you're focusing on that. You're focusing on the negative, so the negative is happening. So you might want to think of that differently and uh, perhaps maybe think about acting about it differently. That way you can actually manifest what you desire as opposed to what you're afraid of. Okay, why do we have the karmic relationship card here for Scorpio? Why do we have karmic relationships? The lovers. Temperance. And the three of pentacles. Lovers, Temperance, and the Three of Pentacles. Oops. Okay, so this is like, once you do figure out that you're focusing on the negative and you change it to, to focusing on the positive or the things that you do desire, then this is signifying that the karmic relationship will be then resolved and you can move on to a relationship that's for you as opposed to a karmic relationship like for the past. Okay, let's get some uh, clarity on these for Scorpio. Let's get a little clarity on this issue for Scorpio. We have the Emperor, okay, the Four of Cups, the Seven of Wands, and the Three of Swords. So this is really saying that with everything that you have going on here, the fact of the matter is, is that you just have to, you know, change your way of thinking on a regular basis for it to become a, a pattern or, or a habit for you. You have to change it consciously enough so that it becomes a pattern, a habit for you, or a pattern. Otherwise, you're going to be disappointed and feel hurt by whoever is around for you to blame. Okay, um, let's get a bit of advice here. Let's get a roll of advice for Scorpio, please. A roll of advice for Scorpio. What's it Scorpio supposed to do about this? The tower. The star. The five of pentacles. And the two of swords. So you do have a choice to make here, for sure. Um, to me, the choice looks like it'll be between two things, but there's always a third option. You might have to look at things differently and choose that third option in order for this to be successful. You do have a tower moment that's signified to be coming up here or could have already happened. 
but it's something that you need to start healing from this. Something you need to start healing from this because you've had a lot of endured a lot of hardships as well due to this situation or situations or in issue. So basically you're gonna you do have to look at things differently and to choose another way of going about things in order to heal this and and you know have things go better for you in the future. Okay, there you have it, Scorpio. If you like this video, please feel free to like, share, comment, donate, subscribe. All of these things will help my channel grow. I appreciate all of your support and I hope you have a wonderful day.